Cdata Connect Cloud provides access to your SharePoint lists in Salesforce. With Connect Cloud's data connectivity as a service, you can easily work with your cloud data in your preferred cloud tools and applications. Let's say I want to access data in Salesforce, but my relevant data is in SharePoint. There is no native support between SharePoint and Salesforce, and that's where Cdata Connect Cloud steps in. To begin, log into Cdata Connect Cloud and navigate to the connections page. Click Add Connection and select SharePoint. Next, fill in the appropriate connection properties, including the URL, SharePoint Edition, Schema, Auth Scheme, User, and Password. Click Save and Test to ensure the connection is configured properly. Also, navigate to the Permissions tab in the Add SharePoint Connection page and update the user-based permissions. After connecting to SharePoint, navigate to the OData page and click Add to create new OData endpoints. Select the SharePoint connection we just created and click Next. Select the tables you wish to work with and click Confirm. Click on Settings in the top right corner, then Access Tokens. Here you can create a new Personal Access Token or PAT or use an existing one. With the connection and OData endpoints configured, you are ready to connect to SharePoint lists from Salesforce. Now, log into Salesforce, then click Setup, then Integrations, then External Data Sources. Click New External Data Source. Enter a label and unique identifier to be used in list views and reports. Select the option Salesforce Connect OData 4.0. Enter the URL to the OData endpoint for Connect Cloud. Select the Writable External Objects option. Select JSON in the Format menu. In the Authentication section, if all members of your organization will use the same credentials to access Connect Cloud, select Name Principal. If the members of your organization will connect with their own credentials, select Per User. For Authentication Protocol, select Password Authentication. For username, enter a CData Connect Cloud username, and for password, enter the user's PAT. After you have created the external data source, you can now create SharePoint external lists. Click Validate and Scan. Select the SharePoint lists you want to work with as external objects. You can now use the external SharePoint lists just as you would standard Salesforce objects. You can create a new tab with the filter list view, run reports of external objects, and create, update, and delete SharePoint data from the Salesforce dashboard. At this point, you have a direct cloud-to-cloud -cloud connection to live SharePoint lists from Salesforce. And that's everything you need to know to establish live connectivity between your SharePoint data and Salesforce Connect. To get started with Cdata Connect Cloud, visit cloud.cdata.com and sign up for a free trial. Thanks for watching, and as always, you can find more resources at cdata.com.